Kurt being a student of rock history, knew that the story of a rock band is essentially a legend, in the sense that there's some wiggle room in the truth as long as it serves the overall myth. So Kurt was an unreliable narrator of his own story. That's nothing new, it would be hard to name any rock star who wasn't the same. It's up to the journalist to determine what's true and what isn't. But sometimes journalists play along because they're naive, lazy, or overworked, or they want to be in on the game because it makes for a sensational copy. Whatever the reason, it works to the artist's advantage. I wasn't rigorous about investigating Kurt's mythologizing. For one thing, a tight deadline meant that I just didn't have the time. And for another, he had charmed me, and I unquestionably bought a lot of his tall tales, which turned out well for him. Kurt sat down at the desk and began reading. He smoked constantly and read intently. I kicked back on the bed and worked on an article or played solitaire on my laptop. It was very quiet.